Compania Microsoft mizează la rândul său pe apropiata convergență dintre telecom și media pentru a dizolva barierele de intrare tradiționale din jurul operatorilor telecom și al furnizorilor lor. Domnul Andrew Lund, directorul pe Europa Centrală și de Est al sectorului de comunicații din cadrul Microsoft, a prezentat la București pe 10 mai serviciile Microsoft pentru operatorii telecom. Acestea sunt bazate pe un concept foarte nou în industrie, acela de software as a service, adică software oferit ca serviciu. All our good friends and colleagues during this session, as well as the one before, um, it also includes media and entertainment companies. So we work a lot with big, big uh, TV companies, big radio companies. The idea being that the convergence of media with big telecoms will happen. Also, the changes in technology, convergence of voice and data. We talked a lot about, sorry, about fixed and mobile as well. We talked a lot about that today, and price-based commoditization. One thing's for sure: the more competitive the market is, the lower the prices go down, which is good for the consumer. It's good for the businesses. People are paying less for their telecom services. It's hard for the telco operators because they then have to add more value, add more differentiation in the services that they offer to their customers. So what are we doing about that? So this, this, uh, this, this presentation slide here, at the bottom you can see the, the ways that we communicate with, with uh, people, and that could be individual consumers or it could be businesses. From PC to, to TV to mobile devices, it's ubiquitous really. What's, what we, what, where we think the, 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 real, um, the real thing that's happening is around the middle cloud there. I know telcos like to talk a lot about cloud, so, so we put cloud into our strategy as well. And that's about meshing up things that the services that you provide today could be ringtones. Meshing up things that we provide could be things like Hotmail. Meshing up things that third party uh, um, companies provide could be something like iTunes. And then, of course, there's the OSS BSS services that make those all work together, which is effectively the, the billing engine that, that drives the, uh, the relationship with the customer. So you've got all those different areas working together. So what we're trying to do is build a framework um, solution that enables them to interact together. In the middle, you've got the service provider, which is effectively the telco or, or the media company they're offering services on a hosted model. And at the side there you can see the Microsoft products that we are now offering as a software as a service model. It's quite a new concept and, and, and it's really taking effect. BT is probably our biggest customer in this software as a service model in Europe. And they've got like many, many thousands of customers buying a lot of these products. The one at the bottom there is a hosted CRM where you know a small company, 50 people, 20 salespeople, they don't need to have a big IT department running a CRM solution. So they rent it at like 25, 30 euros a month per, per receipt. In the consumer, it's more or less the same model, except the products change. Yeah, so there you've got Microsoft TV. Microsoft TV is, is actually the front end 